is your path to be We're all here just for all the fun Now you're jamming, jamming hard, yeah Hype it up all once again Turn it up, it up Now you're jamming, jamming hard, yeah Hype it up all once again Turn it up, it up <sighs> Well, I'm currently running out of ideas. <laughs> Alright guys, it's me, Jack, from from the channel, and obviously it's been a month since I made... Well, it's been a little over a month since I made the um, my manga collection video, which you guys can find on the channel anyway. Um, I thought for this video, since I've got loads of stuff going on in my personal life right now, um, Constantly trying to do things for other people, trying to do stuff at my part-time job, um, trying to maintain relationships, things like that. Um, yeah, I thought it'd be easier. Like, I want to expand more upon like a, um, like more like little trivial things with the channel. Like, obviously, I've shown you guys my fav well, not my favorite, but my the manga collection I own of all the stuff that I've been collecting over the years. And I thought for this one, since obviously I said I'll go back to reviewing anime, because obviously I'm currently working on a new JoJo's Bizarre Adventure video, uh, I thought I would go over the animes I actually do have planned that I will cover on the channel eventually. Now, the title, well obviously I wrote down every single um, uh, title for, of anime, but I'll put a um, poster, to save me time on editing for this, I will just put a poster on the side of the screen. I'll put the poster of the anime and maybe a picture of the manga if I can be like if I really want to push forward for it. But yeah, I'll put yeah, screw it. I'll put a um, a picture of the of a manga volume and I'll put a, the poster of the anime right next to me so you guys can see that. And without further ado, without wasting any more of you guys' time, we can do this quick little video. So this is um, yeah, this is my list of animes that I definitely want to cover on the channel. So each one I've listed down, I will do one for multiple season. I'll do one video like per season if the anime's in multiple seasons, or if it's one I can binge watch in one single go. If it's one that I can binge in a single go, I will do the entire show in one video, if possible. Alright, so obviously the first one I'm currently editing at the moment. Uh, which is Jojo's Bizarre Adventure, Diamond is Unbreakable. You guys all know that I'm a huge fan of Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. Um, obviously I reviewed parts 1, 2 and 3. Uh, part 4, Diamond is Unbreakable is obviously the next one up. Uh, so you guys can keep an eye out on that one when it comes out eventually. Uh, next we got Jojo's Bizarre Adventure, Golden Wind. Uh, obviously only natural when I review parts of Jojo, I have to go to the next season. Because I'm only doing stuff that has currently been adapted into anime. And as far as I know, uh, Steel Ball Run hasn't been announced for an anime adaptation yet. But we do know it's going to happen once Part 6 eventually wraps up on Netflix this year. Uh, then obviously, yeah, after Golden Wind, it'll be Stone Ocean, which I'll be working on once I've done a Diamonds Unbreakable video. And once I've done the um, Golden Wind episode, I will do... Part 6 Stone Ocean as well, but I'm going to wait on that one mainly because I want to wait for all the episodes of the Netflix series to come out first, and then I'll do the entire arc in a video. That just frightened the crap out of me. Just mute my phone because that just made me jump. Um, next, we got Beastars Season 1. Now, with Beastars Season 2, not 2, Season 3 coming out in a couple years, I want to do I want to do Beastars as a kind of as a whole, but then I thought it would be a lot easier if I do each season of Beastars. So I'll do one episode, I'll do one video on season one, where I go into like the history of um, Beastars and like a little little bit of a background or like, info about Beastars itself, like both the manga and the development of the anime. Then I'll obviously review season one. Then the next one, I'll give a brief summary of everything. Um, and then I'll go into like season two's plot, and then you you know what I'm on about, you guys. <laughs> but yeah, other than that, 
Uh, we've got the Full Metal Alchemist OVA series. Obviously, I like Full Metal Alchemist. It's one of my favourite mangas of all time. Uh, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, one of my favourite animes ever made as well. But I thought if I do the OVA series as well, it probably would be pretty good for us. Uh, so, but I want to do both animes of Full Metal Alchemist. Well, both anime shows. I'm not too sure about doing the Full Metal Alchemist movies though. Well, the two anime ones. Mainly because I haven't seen them. Because <laughs> I can't find them, to, well, any legal way to watch them. And plus, finding the Blu ray and the DVD is just a hassle at the moment, really. Then, next, obviously, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. From what I've already. Yeah, from. At the moment, I am currently rereading all of Full Metal Alchemist. And I'm working. Well, I'm writing a video at the moment of FMA Brotherhood. Uh, next, Chainsaw Man. Now, obviously you guys, you guys know I have all the volumes up to this point of the manga. Uh, and I know the anime is currently running at the moment, we're about halfway through the first, well, we're about a quarter through the entirety of the anime at the moment. But I'm waiting, I'm gonna wait till all the episodes of Chainsaw Man are out, then I'll eventually do a review of the current half of Chainsaw Man. So it'll be episodes one through 12, and then when episodes 13 through 24 come out, I'll do an episode on that as well. Next, we've got Spy Family. Um, I will, well, I've started buying the manga recently of Spy Family. I find, I'm finding it really funny at the moment. Uh, I'm watching the current episodes at the moment as well as Spy Family. Uh, once, that, once the season of Spy Family wraps up, uh, I'll definitely, definitely work on a video for that. Uh, next we got Bucky, the first Bucky show on Netflix. Uh, I want to definitely cover that as soon as possible because I haven't read any of the Bucky manga, but I do know some bits and pieces that happened in it, thanks to a few friends that actually told me about Bucky. Uh, I've watched the Netflix, I've watched both Netflix shows, and I'm waiting for the new season, which should be coming out soon, like very very soon in January. But yeah, definitely look out for an episode of Bucky and also Baki Hanma, Son of the Ogre, which I will also cover on the channel once I've done Baki, because I will do the arcs in order. Uh, next we got Way of the House Husband. Uh, I'm currently debating on whether or not I actually do Way of the House Husband. Uh, season 2 is obviously not out yet. I've only read a few panels of the manga on Twitter here and there. It's a really good show, but I will work on a full-blown video just for that as well. Uh, next, we got all four seasons of Attack on Titan. I've only watched season one, and that was back when Attack on Titan first came out. Um, the yeah, so I'll end up rewatching all four seasons of Attack on Titan. Uh, then I'll be doing an episode. Well, I'll be doing a video on each individual season of Attack on Titan. It might take me a while for when I eventually get around to it, because I know the dub of the final season recently finished. But yeah, we can only wait from there, really. <laughs> uh, next we've got Dragon Ball Z Battle of Gods. One of my all-time favourite Dragon Ball movies ever. Uh, I want to cover the current Dragon Ball films. As much as I would like to do like the stuff of the original Dragon Ball or the first 13 Dragon Ball Z films, I thought it'd be a lot better to do like Battle of Gods first because that's what got me back into Dragon Ball as a whole. And plus, it's just you know from my even from my top favorite anime movies of all time video that I posted a long time ago. I did go into a fair amount of depth about how much I love Battle of Gods. <laughs> then, obviously, if I'm going to do Battle of Gods, I've got to go into the next arc, being Dragon Ball Z Resurrection F. Which is also like the first, well not the first, the second arc of Dragon Ball Super. See after I've done Battle of Gods I'll do Resurrection F, not long after that. Then after Resurrection F I'll be doing Dragon Ball Super Broly. A fucking fantastic movie and I also put that in my top favourite anime movies of all time list as well. Uh, then after that I'll be doing Dragon Ball Super Superhero. I saw it in the cinemas, I'm currently waiting on the 4K Blu-ray to come out at the moment. Which I have no idea when that's actually coming out, but when it does, I will absolutely start working on a video for it, without a doubt. 
Next, we got One Piece Film Red. Uh, I started recent, fairly recently getting into One Piece. I started watching the anime because I'm currently still on... I'm taking a break on watching One Piece at the moment, so I watched the Alabaster arc. And I'm currently reading through the One Piece manga as well at the same time. I am finding the manga a lot better than the anime, if I'm honest. But I did when I did go out and see the newest film, One Piece Red, in cinemas, and I absolutely loved it. It was so fantastic. But when the DVD and Blu-ray comes out, I'll do a video on that for you guys. Uh, then we got Panty and Stocking with Garter Belt. With the room, well, with the stuff going around online saying that there's going to be a second season of it. I will definitely be covering this show, because I know it's on Crunchyroll at the moment, and I recently bought up the whole season on DVD, so yeah, we're going to have fun looking into that. Uh, then we got Demons... Oh, I'm about to throw up. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> uh, Demon Slayer Season 1. Uh, I will be more than happy to go through more Shonen stuff. Uh, and since Demon Slayer is really popular at the moment, I thought it would be a good idea to go and talk a little in depth about Demon Slayer, the first season, for a video. Then I'll be doing the Demon Slayer movie, the Mugen Train arc. I'm not doing the TV version because the TV version sucked shit, but that's just my opinion. <laughs> but I will do the Mugen Train movie because uh, obviously the movie version came first before the nine episode version. Um. So yeah, I'll end up doing that, but I will probably try and do a comparison in the video at some point for it. Then we got uh, the Demon Slayer Entertainment District arc um, series, which I recently finished watching as well, because I'm slowly trying to catch up on other animes as well while I'm at it. Uh, then after that we got Berserk, the Golden Age arc, because I know they're doing a episodic version of it on Crunchyroll. But I don't know whether or not I should do that one, or the Golden Age Arc trilogy, well the movie trilogy of the Golden Age Arc. But it's, it's pretty hard to find in the UK at the moment, so wherever wraps up easily, I'll end up doing it. Uh, then next we got My Dress Up Darling. I read all the manga up to this point, uh, I watched season 1, loved it, I laughed, I and cried everything. Uh, with the announcement of season 2 um, from the animation studio, I will definitely release a video about My Dress Up Darling before season 2 comes out. Then we got Netflix's Castlevania. I really, really want to talk about Castlevania at some point in the channel. I should have done it a long, long time ago when season 4 came out, but I'm just going to have to eventually get around to it if, my, if I can schedule my way across to it. Then we got Berserk 97. Uh, if I'm going to talk about the Golden Age Arc trilogy, I might as well talk about the other adaptation of the Golden Age Arc with the 97 Berserk series. I might cover um, the 2016 series of Berserk, but I'm very heavily leaning towards no. <laughs> uh, next we've got Neon Genesis Evangelion. I will not talk about the new movies, well the, the rebooted versions of Evangelion, but I will do the entirety of the original Evangelion series. Um, because it's a classic anime. Uh, then we got more One Piece. Uh, I'll be doing a video on One Piece Gold and One Piece Stampede. The other two recent One Piece films that came before One Piece Red. Maybe because I thought it would just be a good idea. <laughs> and then we got The Death of Evangelion, the first um, Evangelion film, which came out after the show. And then I'll be doing the final Evangelion film of the original series, uh, the end of Evangelion. Uh, other than that, that's all the animes at the moment I have planned to talk about on the channel. But if you guys want to suggest any more, uh, like any more anime, like whether it be a movie or a TV show, feel free to recommend it to me in the comments or on my. Twitter account, so you can easily DM me on Twitter, which is going to be in the description down below. Uh, if you want to guys drop in any recommendations, I will review pretty much any anime as long as I can get it through, obviously, um, YouTube censorship. <laughs> but other than that, um, yeah, you guys want to recommend me any anime at all, feel free to. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell icon, uh, so you'll be notified with every single upload I do. 
And other than that, I uh, hope you guys have a wonderful day.